With 2020 behind us, the promise of a better 2021 is in the horizon. Here to talk to us a little bit more about that is Carlos Briano, Public Information Officer for the Drug Enforcement Administration, El Paso Division. Welcome back, Carlos. Thank you, Susie. Yes, 2020 was a difficult year for many people. We know many people were anxious for a fresh start, and frankly, some are seeing the first seven days of 2021 with a little with little hope. But I'm here to tell you that, and the audience, of course, that the men and women of DEA, we remain committed to keeping our community safe and healthy. Uh, but every American can play a vital part. Yesterday's events at the Capitol have many people on edge. What can we do to help keep our communities safe and healthy? Well, every day and every year, we remind the public about the dangers of drug use, and we ask them to commit to remain drug-free. But let me share a statistic with you. According to the National Institute on Drug Abuse, the estimated monetary cost of drug and substance abuse in the U.S., including illegal drugs, alcohol, and tobacco, was more than $740 billion a year. That figure includes health care, legal costs, lost work productivity. That's uh, obviously an alarming statistic, Carlos. What else do we need to know about the impact of drugs? It is alarming, Susie. Uh, plus, there's other costs to society like crime, unemployment, domestic abuse, divorce, homelessness, effects of un to unborn children, the spread of disease, and regretfully, even overdose deaths. So when we ask people to commit to leave, uh, living drug-free lifestyles, we want people to consider these terrible costs. So, Susie, it's the first week of the new year. Many people have made or are thinking about making a resolution. The men and women of the DEA, we want everyone to add one more, staying away from drugs. Uh, we want that to be one of your resolutions as well. This is going to help our city, our state, and our nation become a safer and healthier nation in 2021. I think that's a great resolution that we can all we can all follow. Thank you, Carlos, so much for joining us once again, and we'll see you back here next week.